This is the popular Obavarame Square in Benin City. Angry pensioners from state and local government have cut off the road, thereby restricting pedestrian and vehicular movement. They are calling on the state government to pay them their gratuity and arrears. Elders and senior citizens of these states are not treated well at all. These are governors that travel overseas only. They see the way Go, uh, uh, the senior citizens and elders of those cities have been treated, but they will not come here and treat us fair. After spending 35 good years, government is, is denying me of my rights. We are begging to survive. We were borrowing money from friends, where we shall, and neighbors from even money lenders to survive. Believing safe that when he eventually starts paying us, the money, the money is paying us, we will use it to offset the debt. We have been out for several occasions now, protesting for our own money, our own right. They are not doing us favor. It's not a gift. It is our right. We have fulfilled our side of the bargain. Some of the protesters said the non-payment of pension arrears have subjected them to untold hardship, with most of their colleagues dying owing to lack of funds for adequate medical care. They appealed to the state government to urgently pay their entitlements. This is what I call systematic elimination of pension, so that they will have enough money. They are dying. Somebody who cannot afford to feed himself, cannot buy drugs to maintain himself, and then you are saying you are not paying, you are not owing. It's too bad. We are here. Begging Edo people, good Edo people, traditional rulers, opinion thoughts, and civil society to help us appeal to the mind of the governor to pay both state and local government pensioners their gratuity, their months of arrears. The protesters later heard an open air prayer session to seek God's intervention in their situation, reacting to the development via telephone. The special advisor to Edo state government on media and publicity. Mr. Kusu Usaigi said the pension and gratuity were not owned by the present administration. Mr. Usaigi, however, said arrangements are on to clear the alleged outstanding areas. Most of the pensioners are reasonable people. They understand the effect the government is making. And I think most of them are not that friendly. The ones or kids, the ones, the people who are there, most of, most of these people are not even pensioners. You know, they're just trying to give, give the government the bad name. You know. I respect that the governor is committed to ensuring that all pensioners are paid as Wellington Hakodeja reporting.